Patrick Awards. As David Adelson reports, the biggest winners were anyone on the show. There was plenty of star power. Right here, Follow this way. There was lots of primetime pizzazz. Oh, yeah, and some awards were given out, too. And the winner is Tony Braxton. Groups walked away with the most hardware at Monday night's 22nd version of the American Music Awards. Boys to Men won three awards, two awards for the single I'll Make Love to You, and one for favorite soul, rhythm, and blues band. I'll make love to you like you want me to. Ace of Bass also collected a pair of pyramids. It's fantastic to be um, nominated and winning an award. Other double award winners were Reba McIntyre for favorite female country artist and favorite country album, and Michael Bolton for favorite male pop rock artist and favorite adult contemporary artist. Well, if that's all. Other winners included Garth Brooks, Anita Baker, Snoop Doggy Dog, The Lion King Album, Tim McGraw, Tony Braxton, Vince Gill, Alabama, and All for One. I swear, like the shadow that's by your side. Pioneer rock monster Led Zeppelin was presented the International Artist Award. A special award was presented to TAFKAP, that's the artist formerly known as Prince. The award was presented to honor the music he made while still known as Prince. Still confused? Join the club. Since the winners of the American Music Awards are supposedly never informed of their victories beforehand, folks wonder how Dick Clark and company attract such a wide variety of big name artists. Well, folks, the answer is as simple as ABC. In fact, as a prime time television show broadcast by ABC, the American Music Awards usually score better ratings than the Grammys. And good ratings mean good record sales. And record sales are the reason record companies are so anxious to have their artists on the show. That would be one good idea, yeah, about appearing on the show. No question. It, it always, uh, you always watch the sales the week after an award show, whatever it be, and, and they always have a, a direct indication and, of, of what an impact that television really has in our industry. You know, everybody's uh, executive staff, comes flies out for this uh it's a great kick in the pants uh for the uh executive staffs at, at the record labels commercial in a commercial way of speaking now with the amas over music industry eyes are now focused on record store cash registers where american music award trophies of a different type will be handed out from the american music awards in los angeles i'm david adelson for e news daily called for them to be extradited there for quote ruining the lives of thousands